Hi, this is how you perform a factory reset of most Chromebooks, something that is good to do both if you're selling or getting rid of the computer or as a means to try and fix any software related issues with it. Please note that following these steps will permanently delete everything stored on the computer, so do back up or move everything you want to keep to a safe place before proceeding. Also, if you're resetting the computer to get rid of any software issues and this does not work for you to fix those issues, there is also an option to completely remove and reinstall the Chrome OS operation system on the computer. I'll link my video to do that up the top here as well as in the video description if you want to try that approach instead. But for most users the normal reset functionality built into Chrome OS that we're going to go through in this video should work just fine. Now a factory reset or as Google funnily calls it a power wash can be initiated both from inside the computer when you are logged in by navigating to settings and then selecting system preferences followed by power wash. The function can also be started even without logging in to the computer at all. To do this, begin by signing out of your Chromebook by clicking down to the right and selecting the on-off symbol followed by sign out. Now, on the keyboard, press and hold Ctrl, Alt, Shift and R. After this, depending on your model, you might first need to select Restart, after which you then get presented with this window. On newer Chromebook models, the reset window should appear right away without any restart needed. From here, just select Power Wash, followed by Continue to initiate the factory reset process. Depending on your Chromebook model, the whole reset procedure can take anywhere from 30 seconds to a few minutes, after which you then get presented with the normal first startup screen. From here, either follow the on-screen instructions to set the computer up again or turn it off if you're selling or getting rid of it to let the next person set it up using their own credentials. Alright, please share any thoughts or questions in the comments below and I'll do my best to answer them. Thank you for watching. Bye!